creating an inquiry listing of desired information from your accounting data is done in three easy steps. Adagio Grid View must be started from a shortcut, and on the shortcut properties, the target path must include the parameter slash C to allow creating views. Without this, you would receive an error when clicking on New. Before starting, it is good to initialize settings from the default screen on the Edit menu. Browse for the location of the company data for the inquiry. Choose Default Settings for the new view definitions. Show all installed dictionaries or just those versions in use for the company. And select the location for where new views will be saved or existing views will be open by default. To start, click the New button on the toolbar or choose New from the File menu. The first step is to select the program for which the desired information belongs. If you are unsure where the information you want to see is stored, a utility program called the Data Dictionary Exporter is available to export the program dictionary list to an Excel workbook. Each tab has a specific table with a list of fields, so you can see if the program has what you need. The five most recently selected modules and versions will be listed at the top to make common inquiry sources easier to locate. If you see multiple versions of a program, make sure you pick the version you use. After choosing the program, the second step is to pick the table with your required data. It could be a master record, posted transactions, batches, posting journals, or many more. Only one table can be selected for a view. The most recently used table will be at the top. The third step is to select the fields for the inquiry, which will appear as columns on the grid. Highlight a field on the left side and either double click it or highlight and click the right arrow to add it to the right side for selection. It may be easier to find required fields by sorting the selection list alphabetically. Click the OK button to confirm the list. Once the fields are chosen, the view definition allows setting other options before the inquiry is complete, such as displaying a grand total row, determining when information is refreshed, and enabling the export to Excel. You can add more field columns from the Fields button if any were missed. Before the view is generated, you can set filter criteria to restrict the number of rows to a manageable volume while working on it and before going live. For smaller files, click the Cancel button to skip the filter phase at this time. Now your view is complete and ready to customize. To save your view, click the Save button on the toolbar and give your inquiry a descriptive file name and a GV file extension. Change the save location to any folder as desired. You can reposition columns by selecting one or more and dragging them to the desired location. Double-click a column title to sort the rows by that field. Resize columns by dragging them as well. There are numerous other features available to tailor the inquiry to your needs. Get the information you need quickly by creating a view into your accounting data. For more information about Adagio Accounting, use these on-screen links or from the video description. Thanks for watching.